About to skip AS15? Wait, let me explain the most important part of the chapter in just 60 seconds with an example. So as you can see, the demand of the question is how should this appear in the balance sheet as an asset or as a liability? We will start with the present value of obligation, reduce the unrecognized past service cost and again reduce the fair value of plan assets. If this amount is positive, this amount goes in the liability side of the balance sheet. But if this amount is negative, then it will appear in the balance sheet as an asset. And here we have to be a little careful. This asset is recognized at the lower of the calculated amount or the present value of economic benefits available as refunds. So if we apply what we learned to this question, the solution is take present value of obligation 1100 rupees, reduce unrecognized past service cost 70 rupees and again reduce fair value of plan assets 1190 rupees. As this amount comes to negative 160, we know it's an asset and we'll recognize this asset at the lower of 160 or PV of available future refunds 90 rupees. So here we recognize an asset of 90 rupees. You've just learned the most asked question from AS15. Try the practice question in the description and share this with the friend who's skipping this chapter.